हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल टारगेट 100 इन मैथमेटिक्स बाय शिवेश कुमार सिंह एंड टुडे इन द सीरीज ऑफ रिवीजन फॉर टर्म थ्री एग्जाम फॉर ग्रेड सिक्स वी आर इन दिस वीडियो टू डिस्कस ऑल पॉसिबल वैरायटी फॉर क्वेश्चन नंबर टू ओके लाइक आई टोल्ड यू इन माई अनदर वीडियोज दैट सिक्वेंस कैन बी चेंज बट वेराइटी ऑफ द क्वेश्चन विल रिमेन सेम ओके लेट स्टार्ट द वीडियो दिस इज Find the area of the triangle in my question. In my question number one video, I told you about area of a parallelogram. So here, first you must remember and write the formula for area of triangle. What is that? It is half of base times height. Okay, height means just remember one thing. Height is always a perpendicular line. Means the line making an angle of 90 degree with the base. Okay, it reminds me very interesting question for you. Like one question can be like this. Maybe they will give you a question like this. They will say, okay, this is just assume that this is 90 degree. It is A. It is B. It is C. And it is D. Okay, question will be which of the following option represents area of the triangle? Option A, half times B times D. Option B, half times B times A. Or option C, half times D times C. Or question option D can be half times D times A. Okay, so in this type of question, you will have to be very very careful with the concept. Why? Because height means the line which is making an angle of ninety degrees. So B will be height, not A, not C. Okay. So this will be the correct answer. Okay, like this. Now let's focus on the question. Question was find the area. So here we need the value of base. We have the value of height. So just put the values here. It is half times base means five and height means six. So just simplify this. Two threes are six. Three times five means fifteen yard square. Okay. Now another question can be find the area. See again, this is the same type of question. So area is equal to half of base multiply by height means half of eight multiply by eight. So simplify eight divided by two is four. Four times eight thirty two feet square. Okay. Now, this type of question. Muhammad is in charge of designing a school pennant for Spirit Week. What is the area of the pennant? So, this complete design we have to find the area. So, area is equal to half times base times height. My dear students, don't be lazy in writing the formula. Okay, every time you write the formula so that you can memorize it. Half times base is three and a half, and height is six and a half. So we will convert this mixed fraction into improper fraction. So this is three times two, six, and six plus one, seven divided by two. Same here, six times two, twelve, and twelve plus one, thirteen divided by two. Now it cannot be simplified because uh, numerator both are prime numbers, so it cannot be cancelled. So thirteen times seven, ninety-one divided by eight. You can write. See, maybe this option will be given in the choice, or it can be written in the mixed fraction also. So, what you will do in that case? You will divide the number. So, it will be eight times one, eight. One remainder, zero. Sorry, one comes down here. One, okay. Then eight ones are eight. Three remainder. So, it, uh, its answer will be eleven and three over eight feet square. Okay, maybe this option chances are very less, but definitely this answer will be given. Okay, now next can be Ibrahim has an A-frame cabin. Means it is a like shape in A form. The back is shown below. If the total area of the window and door is three point five square yards, now see this is the total area. Okay, total area is equal to three point five. Square yard. Okay, this is given. Now, total area means including this wall. Uh, sorry, including this door, window, everything. 
Now, how many square yard of paint will he need to cover the back of the cabin? Now, my dear students, this is very interesting question. Why? Because this question, we have to paint the wall. And you know that painting is done only on the wall, not on the door and the window. So, what we, what we are going to do here? We will try to find the total area, means total area means including this wall, window and door everything and after finding this total area we will subtract this area why because this is the area of door and window so in place of writing total area i should write here area of window and door okay area of window and door is equal to 3.5 now what will be the total area total area is equal to half times base times height means half times 8 times 5 it is given in the question 8 divided by 2 is 4 and 4 times 5 20 square yard okay so area to be painted area to be painted it will be equal to what total area minus area of doors and windows so it will be 20 minus 3.5 means i think it will be 16.5 check the calculation yard square okay like this you can solve the question okay i am sure you have understood this question maybe cost will be given in uh, given for this question so after finding this total final area you just multiply the cost also okay now next question can be if area and height of a triangle is 100 centimeter square and 10 centimeter respectively, then find the base length of the triangle. Okay, so area is half times base times height means 100 centimeter square is the area, half base is we don't know base and height is 10. So just simplify this 10 divided by 2 is 5. So, 5B is equal to 100. So, B is equal to 100 divided by 5. 100 divided by 5 means 20 centimeter. Okay. Like this, you can solve the questions related with the triangle. So, I am sure you have understood this question also. And if you think that such videos will help you to increase your knowledge, please like and subscribe my channel with your friends. Thank you.